welcome back to another game with Big Bob's MTG. I'm Big Bob, and today we got Rampaging for Rosadon as part of our key members of this deck. This deck is all based around Rampaging for Rosadon. I wanted to utilize his abilities as much as possible. And here's how we're going to do it. So, we have our Rampaging for Rosadon, of course. Baffling End, meant to exile those early on creatures and everything. It does come in handy sometimes. Lava Coil is also to exile, deal 4 damage, and get rid of those creatures. Keep them out of the graveyard for people to come uh, try to get them out of the graveyard. You can make sure that... Lava Coil as well, in order to keep those creatures down, out, and exiled from the game. Corpse Knight. Corpse Knight we're going to use in here in order to deal that one extra damage. Now, the one extra damage is all you really need. You'll see in these games that when it comes down to the wire, that one damage matters. That extra little bit matters with this deck. Stormfist Crusader helps us draw and keep spinning through the deck as well as dealing them one damage, one damage, one damage. Bone Crusher Giant in order to deal those two damage and throw out a 4-3 creature if we need to. The Wanderers in here in order to prevent Rampaging Ferocidon from doing damage to us or having uh, other non-combat damage done to us. It also helps us exile another creature with a power 4 or greater unlike Baffling End or Lava Coil that may have a more hardy face on them. Torbrand is in here because of course when Rampaging Ferocidon is dealing them damage, whenever they're playing a creature, now it adds to it, and it deals three damage instead of one, and three, and three, and three. In order to help with that, we have the next two cards. Awaken the Erstwild. This one is so great at, you throw Rampaging Ferocidon out, you have Torbran out, and then you go, Awaken the Erstwild. Awaken the Erstwild makes everybody discard their hand, which hopefully they're drawing into much, much more than normal with Stormfish Crusader. They discard their hand, create those 2-2 two -two tokens, and then your Rampaging Ferocidon takes it away and deals 3 damage per zombie token that comes into play. Now it is going to deal you 1 damage, so hopefully you have either the Wanderer in play or you have enough life in order to survive. If you kill them beforehand, it does not count as you lose because they died first clackbridge troll is another one that gives the opponent creatures when the opponent creates those creatures rampaging for Osan is going to deal them damage if you have torbran out again that's another three damage per zero one white goat token that comes into play it's a great card on top of everything while rampaging for Osan is dealing damage no one can gain life this prevents all those silly life gain decks from getting the upper hand by ramping up their health points to 60, 70, 80, where it's going to be almost impossible to get them down. This negates all life gain. You, them, everything. So as you can see, I don't have any life gain in here because of Rampaging Ferocidon. Thank you very much. Thanks for joining me. Like and subscribe below. Now let's get to the games. Mr. Lanky K. Let's see what has, this guy has for me. Well, let's give it a shot here. More mono red. He's always super fun. Playing some red. Two damage. Swing in for one. Alright, that's three damage so far. This and... He's 
gonna burn out fast if I can get this out here. Keep him at bay. Hopefully he doesn't have a ton more burn. Which I'm sure he does. Okay. Chandra burning! Nope, I'll take that. Alright, now he can only play cards on top of his deck. Which is good for me. didn't do anything to me. I can still clinch this. One card. Alright. Um. Black. And. Black Bitch Troll for the win! <laughs> oh my god, that was cutting the clothes. But man, is that fun! <laughs> Hope and wish for a black mono. We'll see. That guy off the bat. Still black. Four. 
Next up. Five damage. Thanks, Torbrin. a creature damage. He's at six, I'm at four. We'll see who wins this one. Three more damage. Now we can see the final countdown. I have to block that. got to play. <laughs> there we go. Tomahawk. Gonna play the Raging Ferocidon. Which it doesn't look like I have a whole lot to play with. I'm gonna keep it just to see what we can do. Ah. So he's running Golgari. Draw some more cards. Well, not Golgari. It's green red. It just rule again. Okay. gonna enter that. Um, let's see here. And then the corpse thing. One more damage to him. Let's see if we can clinch this one. Okay. Sarkon's on ceiling. That's interesting. Wonderful. Play that. Rage for us about. Dealing one damage. Uh, let's see. Four, seven. Yep, we're good. Oh, not good. I wanted to attack. Why didn't I attack? I am an idiot. 
I could have won. Almost. Four damage to any creature, huh? Two damage to you. What do you got? Okay, well, we finally have our big daddy o's here. I think I'm just gonna wander and then swing in and kill him. Let's get started. Goodbye. See you, don't worry. I'll be quick. And he quits. There we go.